welcome to my channel, The Jamie Joe Show. All right, in this video, we're reviewing The Walking Dead's Origins Maggie episode. And in honor of that, here's my little Maggie. I just wanted to share her with you because she brings me so much joy, just like the one and only Maggie Ree on uh, The Walking Dead does. So, say hi, Maggie. Mm. She, I just woke her up from a nap, so she just probably does not want to be in the rest of this video. So I'm going to go put her down, and we'll get back to it. You'll want to stick around till the end of this video, uh, towards the end of this video, because I include my uh, the opening credits reaction to the Maggie episode, and I also include my reaction to the teaser for season 11 that they play at the end of the Origins episode. So stick around for that, and... Let's get into the review. Okay, so the opening was good, but I have to say it was not as good as Daryl's. Daryl's made me cry. It gave me goosebumps. It was amazing. Uh, Maggie's was more of like, yeah, made me just super pumped and excited. And I'm just so happy to have her back in um, season, well, we got her back in season 10. And I'm so excited to see what season 11 final season brings us. Cannot wait. Uh, I loved watching the beginning of Glenn and Maggie's relationship all over again. Oh my gosh. Because, again, I, I said this in my last video um, with Daryl's origin. It It's misleading because it's not really an origin. It's not like we see what happens before we see the character on The Walking Dead. Uh, it's uh, just basically a recap of everything they've been through through all the seasons. So, we get to see Glenn and Maggie back together from the beginning and their their love is just so adorable and so cute and <sighs> tortured and sad at the same time. Ugh, loved it. So we get we get that. Then we get the prison. Oh my gosh, those were some of my favorite episodes. I loved them at the prison and Maggie stepping up and taking it like a champ when they clear out the prison when they first get there. Love that scene. Loved watching that episode so much. Oh, it was good to see that again. I cried, not gonna lie, I cried all over again when I watched the Lori death scene. Oh, wow, yeah, that was, that was a sad one. That was, yeah, that got me. Um, so I cried all over again at that. Ah, uh, Herschel's death. That kills me too. Like, poor Maggie. Gosh, she went through so, so much. She lost so much throughout the years and throughout the, uh, the show. Oh my gosh. Um, finding out that Beth is alive and then finding that, finding out, seeing her dead. Ugh. <laughs> Well, I, I cried again there too. Man, you're just your heart breaks for Maggie and just how she fell apart after Beth's death. Um, but then she found the strength to pull herself back together and keep on fighting for Glenn and for her new family that she has and the survivors of The Walking Dead. And oh, and they, and they find they find Alexandria and then they meet the saviors. And she helps take out the saviors and well, some of them only a small little bit of them and then she gets pregnant and we're all hopeful and then she meets Megan and of course uh, yeah I definitely cried again <laughs> during the Glenn scene because that you know any anybody who's seen the Glenn scene knows that whew, that was rough to watch but it was exactly like the comic books, well not exactly, I mean the Abraham thing was a little bit extra, but uh, yeah, the Glenn part definitely followed the comics and it was the way it should have been. It, that was the way it had to be. But it was so, so, so sad and heartbreaking. And then I, there was a scene that I had totally forgotten about when Maggie goes to try and move Glenn's body and then Rick and Carl and everybody comes over and they're like, no, we'll, we'll get it, we'll get it. And Rick says, you know, he was, he was our family too. <gasps> Oh boy, yeah, that was sad. That was sad. That got me. <laughs> uh, and yeah, and then it goes through. We she gets to meet Hilltop finally and learns that the baby is okay and she has the baby. And of course, there's Gregory and her uh, hanging Gregory because he tried to murder her at Hilltop because she's the new leader. 
yeah, so we go through all those. And then her leaving Hilltop and going away for a while, and then she comes back in season 10 and helps beat the Whisperers. And now she's kind of in this weird place with Negan because <gasps> he's still alive, which she, um, she let him live, but he is still alive, but he is out. He has been let out. Carol let him out and Carol told her and wow. So <laughs> wow, what's going to happen in season 11? Ah, between those two, I cannot wait. Um, at the very end of the Origins episode, like I said at the beginning of this video, there was a teaser trailer for season 11 with, um, it had Maggie in it, Megan, uh, Daryl, and Gabriel, and who else was there? I can't remember, but it had at least those people and it, oh, it was creepy. So watch my reaction. My, uh, spoiler alert, my toddler is in the background <laughs> making noise of the reaction because that's when I watched it. So my toddler was there. So you, you get to hear her in the background. Anyway, if you like this video, hit that like button. If you enjoy my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Help me grow and help this channel grow and watch for more videos. Bye. Check out the reactions. This is our home now. So you'll have to start to call me by my name. Not Marsha, not Dear, not Honey. Maggie. Yeah. Maggie Reed. The apocalypse has taken a lot from Maggie, but even as the world was falling apart, her own world opened up. We have to keep our faith in each other. We can hold on to that with everything we have. The future is ours. Maggie has done the impossible in the apocalypse. She found love. <laughs> she found herself. And she created light in a world that belongs otherwise only to the dead. So how did this farmer's daughter become a confident leader with her sights set on a bright future? You're about to find out. This is Maggie's story. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Ugh. Oh, there's me and, and Daryl and Gabriel. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, I just should have expected that. <laughs> Why didn't you make any noise? Why didn't you make any noise? Throw a flash so deep at almost 7 10. Oh. You guys were going after this? No. These people were killed during the fall. grave that could still be in use so i am asking you are you sure all of them were killed during the fall <gasps> take each one out clear the path maggie hold up i'll stop it we're not stopping 